You are the ones that brought Miss Sarah in. Yes, I'm her friend. How is she doing? I am sorry, but she didn't make it. <laughs> what? She was fine. No, 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 no. Yes, but you brought her in too late. <gasps> what she died due to the substance she took and by the time you brought her in it was too late the substance couldn't be taken out of her sarah no no don't do this to me please no i am sorry we did all we could sarah why do you do this to me no you can't be done this was not our agreement together becky i'm sorry Sarah is gone. I'm sorry, Becky. Yes, man. That's what happened. Wow. This is becoming too much. I can't believe a fellow human would do that to a fellow human. Seems like time around has gone all wrong for Tom. I don't know what they gain in this kind of activity they involve themselves in. This game is getting out of hand. I am so hungry, Dan. Do you see what their stupid life cost an innocent girl? I'm serious. Like, if you see how beautiful Sarah was, and now she's something else. As you tell me this, I just feel so hungry within my spirit. Like, why would this happen to her? If only the acid was poured on Tom, it would have been better. Yes, perfect punishment to him and everything bad he has done so far. Yes, but things like that don't happen. It's the innocent that suffer. I hope now you will understand why they need to stop. True. Only God knows what's going on in that girl's mind right now. She will get better and pass it. I hope Tom and Jerry stop this. More reason I don't want Abigail with Jerry. But she wouldn't listen to me. I went to see him yesterday, but it seems like he won't listen. He keeps saying that he loves her. Baby, I have a surprise for you. What is it? You are so eager. Look at your face. Yes, I want to know what the surprise is all about. That's why. Be a little patient. You will know soon. Baby, you know I don't like suspense. Just tell me what it is. The suspense is the fun part, baby. There's nothing fun in it, love. Just tell me. Here, take this. What is it? Open it first and check it out. Oh, baby. Surprise! That's your promotion letter. You've been promoted. Thank you so much, ma'am. Who's your mom? I thought you stopped calling me that. I'm sorry. I'm just too overwhelmed. Thank you so much, my love. I love you. I love you too. Wow. I wasn't expecting this. I'm short of words. Then say nothing. You deserve it. That's what you keep saying, but we have not found a solution yet. Victoria, we have to find a way. Why are you so terrified, Jessica? What is happening? The nightmare is bad and keeps getting worse every day. What do you mean? I saw her kill me and she promised she would do the same to Dan. This is getting out of hand? Yes. I told my son about it. All he did was just laugh it over. I don't know what to say now. It's getting scary. Yes, it is. She told me that there is nothing she can do about it to save him. I would suggest we take her out of the way. We have been suggesting it, but it is not working. We can't. You know we are not murderers. Yes, I know that. But that's what you do to someone that does not want to give you peace of mind. Let's try another option. If that doesn't work out, then we will have no choice but to listen to you. I hope you come up with something soon, Jessica. I will. How are things with you? Fine. Just that Gray and Abigail are giving me serious problems. What happened? Gray is against the person his sister is with and this is causing serious issues now in the house. You should speak with him. Abigail is a big girl to choose who she wants to be with. Same thing I told him, but he wouldn't listen to me. You know how stubborn he can be. He will have no choice but to stay away from her. We can't allow, allow him do what he does to others to her. Abigail is too fragile for that. It won't even happen. Hello big bro. Hello Dan. How are you? I'm fine. And you? I'm fine too. What's up man? My brother here has something to say to you. Is that not right, Gary? I don't know. We agreed on this. So just say it. What did you two agree on? Am I safe? Yes, you are. Gary wants to apologize for everything and also about yesterday. I did a lot of thinking and with the information I just got now, I have nothing to say to him. What is the meaning of this? Do you know what? What? Get out of this office. I don't want to see you here, Jerry. You can't do that. I can and I'm sure Dan doesn't want to see him too. I and Dan have the higher stake here. If he's leaving, I'm also leaving too. Suit yourself.
What are you sorry for? This was what you wanted, right? No, I never wanted this. I love her. You killed her. I, I know it's my fault. I'm sorry. Stop saying that. You caused everything that happened to her. You did. I never wanted Sarah dead. I would never wish that. I don't care. You are evil and caused the destruction of everything good in his life. Vicky. You should stop calling my name. I don't want to hear what you have to say anymore. <laughs> I never wanted this. You're wicked, Tom. I wish Sarah never met you. All you did was bring pain into her life. Be patient, Gary. You don't want to chase Abigail away. It will be best for everyone if she chooses to go back to the States. Do you think that would be the best? Yes, it will. At least all this drama between her and Jerry will stop. Hey, baby. Sarah is dead. What? How? I'm just leaving the hospital now. Sarah is dead. But she was fine. How is that possible? She took poison, Dan. She killed herself. Damn it. <laughs> She killed herself because she couldn't live with her face that way. I'm so sorry, baby. Why did this happen to her? She didn't deserve this. Where are you now? I'm just leaving the hospital. I'm going home. Okay, I'm coming to you now. What happened? It's Becky. She said Sarah is dead. What? What happened? She said Sarah poisoned herself. She couldn't keep living that way. Wow, that's bad, man. Yes, it is. I'm going to meet her. Please, send my regards to her. Maybe I know you're angry, but forget it. No, I'm not. He's supposed to apologize to you. See, let's forget about this apologizing self, okay? No, I'm not going to forget about it. Look at how he spoke to me at the office. I know, but you should forget it. You know how Gary is. This is becoming so much. I can't take it anymore. What's wrong with him? Let's just forget about it and go and celebrate my promotion. I'm not in the mood for that right now. He should apologize to you. But you know that his apologizing won't change anything, right? It will change a lot. Let's forget about that, baby, please. Sarah, why did you do this to you? Why did you do this? You shouldn't have killed yourself. What do you want me to do now? I'm going to be all alone. Dan, it's you? Yes, it's me. How are you, love? I'm not fine, Dan. Sarah is dead. I'm so sorry about that. Why did she do that? Why? I'm sure she did what she thought was best. Why did she kill herself? We had so many plans together, Dan. I'm so sorry, baby. She's the only family I have. She's my everything, Dan. What am I going to do? I know how close you two were. I'm so sorry. Why all? Why did all these bad things happen to her? She's a good person and always watches out for others. It's not her fault. She was just unlucky to meet guys like Tom. All this happened because of Tom. I wish they never met. Me too. I really miss her. She shouldn't have died. She shouldn't. A big girl will never be with Jerry. She's too good for him. She deserves someone better. Someone who will love and appreciate her. Jerry is a jerk. He doesn't deserve her. She's dead. She killed herself. No. Never. I will not let Abigail be with him. We we'll know which of his asses is after him like Tom and they end up hurting Abigail. I can't allow that. I just wish Abigail would listen to me and do as I say. But she wouldn't. She's too stubborn. Every day, just run. But isn't it the perfect tonight? Something about a perfect Here you are. You haven't been picking your calls. I've been busy. Busy. You didn't come to work. There's a lot happening right now, more than just work. And what's that? That's because I have, a, I have a lot to tie up, Jerry. What's wrong with you? A lot is wrong with me. Such as, if you don't talk, how will I know how to help? Sarah is dead. What? It's true. She died today. Wow. I'm sorry, man. She killed herself because she don't. She didn't like how she looked. Killed herself. This is bad. Yes, I went over to her place and then she came out and was throwing up blood. I can't believe Sarah is dead. She shouldn't have died. I'm sorry for the loss. I don't know what to do, Jerry. Mm -hmm.